Hello folks, live from Arlie, Montana. We are having another barn sale, number 10 down here at the big auction barn. Uh, this is quite possibly the biggest sale uh, that we've had at the barn so far. And I'm just gonna walk around and kind of show you some of the items and do a preview video. I'm gonna try to move fairly fast. So uh, this sale opens live on Wednesday the 12th for bidding and it will close on Wednesday the 19th. So starting over here, kind of in the back corner, we've got a swather, a Heston swather and a round baler of Vermeer. We've got a really nice chuck wagon, uh, all original, been restored back in 97. And then another pull type swather. All right, looking over here in the equipment yard, we do have a 40 foot container with the side doors, a 20 foot over there. And we've got several of these eight, nine and 11 foot uh, containers. These, these smaller containers all have a man door and a window. So take a close look at those. We've also got this uh, light new, I'll say it's just a couple years old, Premier uh, 10 by 20 barn style shed this sale has an awful lot of uh, vehicles in it as you can see these are kind of the non-runners they've got uh, all the descriptions show what they need or what's wrong with them or what state of uh, repair there's some classics in here as well so there's an awful lot of vehicles in this lineup and there's another lineup of vehicles that are runners i'll go to them later on here we've got a nice little aluminum boat that uh, looks like it's a 10 footer um a low mile can-am uh, 650 four-wheel drive four-wheeler several uh parts machines are not part well like so they run but they haven't been running for a while they just need some this one needs a little fresh gas hondas uh we've got a blown engine in this honda pioneer and we've got a really nice uh, super low mile diesel Kubota. The spray tank will sell separate, and uh, but it's also selling. It's a nice little sprayer unit. Um, super low miles, low hours on that diesel Kubota. We've got a razor here that runs and drives as it should. It's a great little machine. Thought I'd show you here real quick. Uh, couple of these classics we've got this old holiday i believe it's a 51 or somewhere in the early 50s a 68 bug again these are non-runners there's a 77 ford uh pickup f-150 and there's an older 68 gmc as well on this lineup here we've got a tractor bucket some implements um Calf table, Thorson uh, squeeze and, and calf table. There's an eight wheel rake here. There's 40 fence posts here and they're all the big heavy brace posts. So you wanna take a look at that. Uh, work saver post pounder like new. A uh, couple of headache racks for a semi, a nice flat bed. And look at the bunks of lumber folks. There's three bunks of this eight foot tongue and groove cedar. There's three bunks of that, and then there's some 16-foot 2x10s as well as some 20-foot 2x10s with a brush finish. Really nice lumber. We're selling them by the bunk. A couple other older farm implements. And added into the sale, we've got this 999 Rogue, 1,000cc Kawasaki Rogue Bad Boy Mower. 340 some hours on that and we're selling this separate but it's a snow plow it's a receiver hitch plow um that uh fits right on the front of this mower but we are going to sell them separated here we've got a few more implements and attachments some bale spears quick touches a ditcher just that kind of stuff and there are two school buses in this uh sale as well all right, folks, there are eight of these gates. They're 16 foot wide, uh, heavy duty gates that, uh, yeah, great entryway gates. 
All right, folks, still in the yard here. We're on the running lineup, uh, running, driving, or, you know, some of them. This is a 2015 Chrysler 200 with 87,000 miles. We've got a Deer Hit, Volkswagen Jetta, GMC, and that runs and drives. It just has damage. The GMC runs and drives. Uh, this one here runs and drives. This older straight body uh, uh, Sierra Cloud 9. Um, half ton two wheel drive, good little truck. Um, we've got a 71 Mercedes here, uh, that, uh, uh, just needs the carbs put on and the carbs are in the back. They're all cleaned, rebuilt and ready to go. We've got a little S10 here that runs and drives a Denali GMC Yukon runs and drives. Um, we've got a brand new load trail. Uh, utility ATV type trailer ramp style brand new never never it's been pulled from Ronan to here it is uh, 2022 it's older stock but it came from a dealer up north another utility trailer here we've got a 1968 silver streak that is in incredible condition take a look at that and then we've got another a Cavalier camper here a pull type travel trailer in this sale as well setting here over to the side we've got a mac 10,000 pound two post lift in great working condition uh, ready to load up and send a, a new shop down in this corner we've got uh, a little bit of uh, metal and railroad beams or bridge timbers PVC, we've got some nice kayaks. Uh, I think there's six kayaks in this sale. A little bit of iron and things like that. Uh, I'm just gonna kind of walk down through here. I'm not gonna talk a whole lot about what we've got. Antique lamp posts. There's a bunch of uh, 67 to 72 truck parts, body parts. Um, Hope you can see all this. I mean, there's just lots and lots of stuff in this sale. A lot of underlift equipment. Uh, quite a few nice takeoff tires. Air compressors. Some nice log type furniture. Um, a lot of engines. Um, there's a Cummins there. There's a whole bunch of engines in this sale. Canoe, some water sports, lawn mowers. Uh, wood chipper, exercise equipment, just lots and lots of stuff out here outside this, this sale, folks. More tilers and wheels and shop equipment, presses, scaffolding, nice Miller Bobcat welder. Um, again, more underlift equipment as well as engine stands. And you just got to take a look. Take the time. And look early at this sale, folks. Um, there's a whole hog rotisserie there under that tarp. So let's go inside the barn. We haven't even got started yet. All right, folks. You're going to see inside the barn here. We've got just an awful lot of uh, uh, automotive stuff at this sale there are some antiques and some great fun stuff as well as the automotive but um, we're selling out an entire Napa Auto Care Center so uh, here we've got this brake lathe and lots and lots of these cabinets these Napa cabinets all right walking down here on the east wing of the barn I'll just kind of show you I mean there's just, I mean, hand tools and power tools, and you're really gonna have to take a minute and uh, and really look at uh, this sale. There's nearly a thousand lots. Get on there and do your watch list. There's all kind. Look at all these Fisher Price uh, uh, '60s and '70s toys. Um, a lot of specialty tools. Snap on. Uh, it just i mean everything under the sun furniture we've got some great signage as well lots of lots of uh you know oil and beer memorabilia 
There's a Budweiser mirror there. A lot of NASCAR stuff. Um, a little bit of Christmas stuff. Some vintage uh, uh, oil cans. Some collectible uh, nativity set stuff as well. There's a porta cool. All right, I'm gonna. Oh, and all these signs are stacked up. I can't pull them all out, but they are all cataloged. All right, folks, here we've got an incredible amount of like new DeWalt tools and weed eaters, good stuff. Um, more engines, there's a whole row of engines. A lot of auto body stuff in this sale as well. We had picked up an auto body shop in Pablo, Montana. Lots of paints and things like that. I realize this is a long video, but there's an awful lot to show you folks. I just kind of wanted to, a lot of really like new equipment. There's a drywall jack, lots of uh, bottles of acetylene and argon and oxygen. Uh, just take a look. There's, there's an old army generator in that crate, a brand new English wheel. strut compressor uh, lots of heads and blocks there's a parts washer it's a hotsy um, just a super good uh, automatic parts washer some wool clothing just kind of walking fast here um, take a look though and there's stuff under all of these tables as well so more engines and then i'll go down here uh, on this row volkswagen engines there's two of those there's all kinds of engines you need to take a look folks uh oh these uh genuine draft signs they're dirty but they're in great shape they're all nascar beer signs as well as more engines there's a big cummins engine there We've also got a lot of Coke uh, and older refrigerators. So these bins are full of hardware. But old antique type fridges, Coca-Cola machines. Um, get on there and take a look. Again, a bunch more cabinets. Uh, you know, the, the whole Napa shops in here. Now we're going to jump to the west one. All right, looking over here at the West Wing. Thanks for sticking with me, folks. We've got a Lincoln uh, MIG welder. It's a 180 and a plasma cutter. Got some more furniture, refrigerators. Um, we've got several, I think there's four of these big tool uh, bench uh, box cabinets. They're like nine feet long or something like that. Take a look. More furniture, more cabinets. If you're wanting to rig up your shop, there's a little bit of artwork in this sale, not much. Um, another good big uh, upright air compressor, miter chop saws for wood, chop saws for seal, steel. Nice little comfort zone electric uh, job site heater, fans, um, hardwood flooring saddles folks we've got it all going on here there's a lot of items about a thousand lots take some time over the next few days and make your watch list and and uh get on get online and bid we're we're uh opening up for bidding wednesday june 12th and we're closing wednesday june 19th so preview all day Monday, two and Tuesday and Wednesday, the 17th, 18th, and 19th. So come down and see us and take a look. There's so much here that it's going to take a minute to look through it. Rivers West Auction, Arlie, Montana.